let me just say that $50 billion is the total request when you add the OCO and the core elements and the AID. Um, it's equal to about 1 percent of the federal budget. Cuba remains as the only country in the Americas to be classified as not free by a Freedom House. Mr. Secretary, by any objective measure, the Castro regime has not improved its human rights record. If anything, it has gotten worse. That component is not going to change as rapidly as other components, but it's changing. Another example, if I could, you said that you were confident that we would defeat, you said Daesh, but most of us refer to ISIS or ISIL. I just don't believe this administration has a plan or the will to defeat them. The Iraqis have taken back 40 percent of the territory that they held in Iraq. We've liberated Tikrit. We've liberated, they have liberated Tikrit. They've liberated Ramadi. Ramadi, they're now moving on uh, heat. They're going to be doing that in Mosul. We've cut off the main road between Iraqa and Mosul. The secondary roads are being cut off. What is the status after we have the agreement as far as the focal point of, number one, the issue of uh, nuclear weapons? Where are we? Do we feel secure? There will be an ongoing process of, um, uh, of extremely intrusive but agreed upon uh, verification of the continued compliance with this agreement. And our intel community and energy department, which is responsible for our own nuclear weapons, have assured us that they believe they are capable of knowing exactly what is going on and the compliance is taking place.